What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to fix frame rate drops and random stuttering while playing CSGO on your PC. This guide will be aimed at low to mid NPCs and everything you need will be listed in the description below. In most cases, FPS drops are caused by a bottlenecked graphics card, your CPU or if you have memory issues while playing the game. First, let's take a look at your in-game settings. Here in the video section, Make sure to set your display mode to full screen. This will allow you to change your in-game resolution and aspect ratio. In case one of the next tweaks prevent the game from dropping frames or stuttering, then I strongly suggest to lower the resolution to 1600 by 900 for example. Below, disable laptop power savings and in your advanced video settings, set the global shadow quality to low and the other options should be lowered as well, depending on your system specs especially effects and shaders, can be taxing to your frame rate. Make sure to leave the multi-core rendering option enabled and set the uber shaders option to automatic. Next, in the game section of your settings, make sure to enable the developer console. This will allow you to use some commands such as displaying your current frame rate on the top left of your screen. I will leave all of the commands I use in the description below. When this is done, leave the game running and open up your task manager. Here in the Processes tab, right-click CSGO and select to go to Details. In the Details tab, the CSGO.exe application should be highlighted. Simply right-click it and set the priority to High. This will in turn allocate more resources to playing the game and should increase your performance, especially if you have other programs running in the background. In order to reduce the CPU utilization from other applications, I suggest you to end some processes from running in the background in the Processes tab, which you don't need when playing the game. But make sure to only add programs from running, which you know won't break your operating system. You can now close the game and your Task Manager. Next, open up your Steam Library. Here, right-click Counter-Strike Global Offensive and navigate to the game's properties. In the General tab, select Set Launch Options. The commands you enter into this dialog box will be applied to the game every time you launch it. These commands will make sure that the game is utilizing the most frame assistance performance and it will in turn also reduce the overall performance needed to run it on your system. If in any case one of these commands worsens your performance, for example for systems running on a dual core CPU, then you can always remove the command after. I will briefly go over the most important console commands. FPS Max Zero. This command will uncap your FPS when setting the value to zero. Or you can cap it to let's say 200 when using the command with a value of 200. I suggest to cap your FPS to a value higher than your screen's refresh rate. CL Show FPS 1. When using this command, you will be able to see your current frame rate on the top left of your screen when playing the game. High. This will simply set the game's priority to high, compared to other programs running in the background. I will leave them all in the description below, along with other commands I use to improve the overall performance of the game. You should also make sure that your game files are complete and up to date. In the Local Files tab, select Verify Integrity of Game Files. This will take a minute to re-download any missing or corrupted game files. Next. Make sure that your peripherals and other devices are running the latest driver. In some cases, outdated driver software for your components can be the culprit of stuttering or FPS drops. Search for Device Manager in your taskbar search to open it up. On this window, expand Mice and other pointing devices. Right-click the device you are using, select Update Driver and then search automatically for updated driver software. In case you're unsure about which device you're currently using, then repeat this step for each device. You should also update your network adapter, display adapter and disk driver. When this is done, close this window and make sure that your graphics driver is up to date. This step can make the biggest performance difference, depending on how often you're updating your driver. In case you're using an Nvidia graphics card, then I suggest using the GeForce Experience application. Otherwise, you can also use the AMD driver suit. In the Drivers tab, simply click on Download, 
and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. In the Home tab, select Details for CSGO and then select this wrench icon. This allows you to optimize some options for performance when using the slider system. Lastly, in your settings under General, make sure that the in-game overlay is turned off. This can in some cases result in random lag when enabled, especially on systems running on a low-end CPU. You can now close this window and search for update in your taskbar search to open up your search for updates system settings window. Here, make sure to download the latest update and restart your PC to install it. When this is done, it will change some OS settings, which are usually turned on by default and could reduce your overall performance, especially when using demanding applications. Search for Game Bar to open up the Game Bar system settings. Here, uncheck the recording option and in the Captures tab, make sure to additionally disable the background recording option. These settings will only reduce your performance. If you want to record your gameplay, then I suggest using OBS Studio or an external capture card if you lack performance. When this is done, search for Graphic Settings and open up your Graphic System Settings. On this window, select Browse and your File Explorer will open up. From here, navigate to the drive on which you saved the game on. Program Files Steam Apps Common Counter-Strike Global Offensive and here select the CSGO application and then add it to the program list. Once it's added, you can change the options of the application so that the graphics preference is set to high performance. Don't forget to apply your changes. Again, in your settings, look up Startup to open up your Startup Apps options. Here, you should disable apps from automatically starting up on System Boot. Especially applications such as Skype or Discord can be taxing to your overall system performance and should be enabled when you actually plan on using them, such as Steam. Next, we will change a few settings in your NVIDIA control panel. Right-click your desktop and select to open it up. Here, navigate to Manage 3D Settings and then Program Settings. Select to add a program to customize and then add CSGO from the program list. Below, we will change a few settings. Make sure that the CUDA setting is set to your main GPU. Set the power management mode to prefer maximum performance and set the texture filtering quality to performance. Make sure to apply your changes as this will improve the game's performance when using a low-end graphics card. In case you have decent system performance and none of these steps helped you out, then you might have malware running on your system. You should uninstall recently installed software to find out which application is causing the issue. In some cases, Adobe applications or Shadowplay reserve a big part of your memory to run in the background. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.